Hey everyone, Martin Favre here, Galaxy Sailor Productions. Thanks for watching another episode. This time, I'm gonna talk about something that's really, really important to all of your productions. Everybody's always asking about it. Everybody's always wanting to try to figure it out. And that is, what is the best camera to have? Every single year, the technologies change. There's always new stuff coming out. There's always improvements, firmware, the way it's processed, what gets adapted to what and who and how does it all go. The technology is always being pushed. You can go to all sorts of electronic consumer shows and see what people are doing at professional levels, at prosumer levels, and it's amazing what the technology is constantly doing. So today I'm actually gonna talk to you about the very best camera to have. This is without a doubt a fail safe. You can try all sorts of different cameras, you can watch all sorts of other tutorials, but this is the one. This is the one that is going to be always the best camera for you to have. And that is this right here. It's not a camera, is it? This is an audio person. You know what, the technology does change every year, but everybody is always excited about what the new camera is. Just like all those things that I listed off a little while ago, you can listen in on NAB and everybody is announcing all of their new cameras and all the new things that their cameras are doing and how the prices are coming down and the compactness of it or whatever else. But nobody ever talks about what the new audio gear is. I did the Craigslist route of answering ads, working on people's sets, doing things for free, and everybody that's in film, whether you've been in here for 20 minutes or 20 years, all know the jokes, they all know the offers, and they've all seen the place where there's the person saying, I want a red, I want your big camera. The DSLR revolution came on and everyone was saying, you have to shoot on a 5D, it has to be a Mark II, then it was a Mark III. GH4 is now a thing. And I don't want to say that cameras aren't important. I am not saying anything negative about cameras. People that are directors of photography, cinematography, not at all. My point is that your audio person is extremely important. I'm really saying that you should be looking at your audio person as equally important as your camera and your camera operators. You're making a film you're gonna have it on camera. Heck, your phone shoots 1080p right now, more than likely. But take care in your audio people. Find good audio people, find the ones that have good gear, and treat them well on set. Respect what they're doing, work with them as closely as you would any other aspect of any other department. A lot of times, sound people have told me about people are not telling them when they've cut or that they're going on without them and they're not explaining what the set and the shoot and the blah, blah, blah. Because for some reason, having a deck on you and having a boom pole isn't the same as having the newest camera released at NAB. Your audio people are the most important thing on set once that camera starts to roll. You can fix a lot of things in post with cameras, and by no means am I telling you that you should be shooting in a way that someone's going to fix it in post or that you are going to. But what I am saying is, is that audio can a lot of times be very unforgiving. People don't take that into account. Work with your audio people. Communicate with your audio people. Learn what they're doing. Put those headphones on and try to be in their position sometimes. Treat them well, treat them with respect, and work with them. Pay attention to what it is that they're doing and have them be a part of what is going on in your film. You won't regret it. Thank you so much. Make sure you check out the description below with links to the website, to the Twitter, to the Facebook, to whatever else. If you have any kind of questions or comments, please feel free to leave them below. If you wanna reach out and tell me anything that you would like to see or be a part of in this, please feel free to. I hope to be able to have you come to the next episode. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm.